Well, how are we doing out there? I hope you're all absolutely spot on and thank you very much for watching this video. Now, I've been shopping. I've been to Aldi. Come and have a look what I've got. So, I seen this cuisine, inspired cuisine, lamb hot pot and it was the tag I'd knew. So, I had to buy it, didn't I? Made with British lamb. And it was £1.99, so... Let's get it open and see what we've got. There we go, this is that. Beautiful sunny day today, so I can get a little bit better light for you. There we go, look at that. This is that. And it stopped raining as well. So we've had his rain the last few days. Um, so here we go, let's have a look at this. So there, there is the nutritional information. If you want to pause that and have a look at that, by all means. 421 calories. This is the sort of food you want in winter, isn't it, this? Um, uh, cooked minced lamb in rich onion gravy with carrots and peas topped with roasted sliced potatoes. It's what you want, isn't it, on a day like... Well, it's sunny out there. It's freezing, though, <laughs> let's be honest. Uh, and there are the ingredients there, look, there's a few in bold there, wheat, allergies, um, it's got lamb 23%, potatoes 23%, carrot 6%, peas 6%. So they are the ingredients there. 450 gram box, GB, and it says there, doesn't it, made with British lamb. Um, so there's a few green ones there, traffic light system, haven't we? We've got amber there and salt. So it's a lamb hot pot. This is that. So let's have a look at the cooking instructions. So they are the cooking instructions from chilled fan 170 from the oven. It's a chilled, it's not frozen, it's been in the fridge. Um, 30 minutes, electric 190, 35 minutes and gas 5, 35 minutes. From frozen is fan 170, 55. Electric 190, 60, gas 5, 60. Or you can do it in the microwave look as well. Cook from chilled in the microwave. So I'm going to do it in the microwave. Less on the bills. So there we go, look. So it's 800. It, there's a different wattages there. It tells you, doesn't it? Uh, mine's an 800 watt, so it's anywhere between there. So let's get it cooked. Let's, so what did you say about microwave? Hang on a minute. You've got a piece of film lid. Place on a microwavable plate and cook and full power the time specified. Leave to stand for one minute. So there we go. Look, um, I got a message as well off a truck driver, a HDV driver. He does a lot of driving up and down the country. And I doff my cap to you drivers out there. And he said, can you do some ready meals that you can do in the microwave? I said, well, I've done loads of them in the past, but I'll, I'll endeavour to find one and uh, farm this one. So this is going out to you, all the truckers out there who are... Uh, you know, basically the backbone of the country, aren't they? Providing us with all this food. So this is for you, this one. So I've got it in the oven now. Uh, sorry, in the microwave. Uh, it's about six and a half minutes. So, uh, you know, if uh, this is your sort of thing, if you like this kind of video, please give the video a thumbs up. Um, and if you're not subscribed, then, um, well, maybe consider subscribing. Hit that bell icon and you won't miss any of my videos. Just like to thank loads of foodies who've been joining the channel uh, lately. It's been fantastic. Thank you very much. Um, I do loads of food reviews, all sorts of different stuff, you know. Um, yeah, you're a foodie, so I say foodies. That's like me, I'm a foodie, so. Leave a comment as well. Let me know if you've had this. I, I, I'm not I've not seen it before, so whether it is new and it's, it's sort of, it, or it's been out ages ago and they've brought it back. And it's new in my store in Aldi. Let me know. So I'll bring it back when it's done. So it's done. There we go. Look, this is that. I'll put it on there. Let me get a bit, a bit of light for you. There we go. This is that look. Smells good. I'll be honest. I can smell it now. It's smelling good. <laughs> Can't wait to get into this. So it's Friday today, um, I'm not going live tonight, um, I'll let you know in the community, um, on the community when I do go live, uh, I don't do every Friday, I've 
it's a bit sporadic, it's as and when. I'll speak to my good lady later. So it might be on, I don't know yet, but I'll let you know in the community if I go live tonight. It'll be eight o'clock if I do, but at the moment I'm not. So it might change. <laughs> I don't know. So let's get into this lamb hot pot then. So I'm going to put it on a plate. I'm going to be civilised, look. I'm going to put it on a plate. Go look at that. Whoa. Good portion, I'll be honest. It's I can smell the onion as well. And the spices, I can smell spices in it. There we go, look. I'll put that to one side. I always wash that and recycle, so there we go. This is that look. I mean, you can add stuff to this, can't you? You do a load of more peas and carrots, couldn't you? Um, you could do all sorts, really. You add all sorts to it, couldn't you, really? Uh, gravy, you can make some gravy up, but I'm, it's because it's, it's lamb that I'm putting some mint sauce on. So I'll try it without the mint sauce first for that, um, and see what it's like. So let's, it's all, it's, it's like minced lamb, isn't it? It's not, it's not like chunk, it's not like chunks of lamb, so you've got the onion there as well, look. And I dare say if you did it in the oven, all them potatoes would go all crisp and add an extra bit of crunch, a bit of texture. You know, to your mouthfeel, which is important, isn't it? Mmm. Oh, it's lovely. It's oniony. If you if you don't like onions, if you like no, it's, yeah. If you don't like onions, oh, it's one of them anyway. <laughs> If you don't like onions, you won't like this. That's what I was getting at. Because <laughs> it's very oniony. There's a lot of onions in there as well. And I've got a bit of bite to them as well. I think it needs a bit more seasoning for me. Um, it's quite a mild flavour. Um, not too overpowering. So if you, if you like mild, then that's fine. Just... Mm. The lamb's soft. Peas. Peas are peas. Tasty. Right, let's try a bit of potato. Mmm, it is tasty, it's a tasty dish. However, it does need a little bit more seasoning for me. I would be inclined to stick some more salt and pepper on it. Um, the salt is in amber at one, one gram 66. So I do like my salt, I know it's wrong, but there we go. It's just one of those things. Got um, detected rosemary then as well. They're all the sort of herbs that go with a, a lamb, aren't they, rosemary? I detected that. It's oniony. Um, but like I say, the only thing it's lacking is a bit more seasoning. That's the only thing I would say is a bit more seasoning. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to stick a bit of this mint sauce. I do like mint sauce, look. M -m -m mint sauce over it. Let's see if I can enhance the flavour a little bit and it's gonna do it's gonna isn't it I mean it's it's look I love mint sauce I mean if you don't like it then it's no good is it but you can add your own gravy as well the gravy's okay with it with the dish it's nothing special so you know it's not outstandingly special the gravy mm. oh I've just elevated it <laughs> I've just elevated the dish now putting the mint sauce on there we go So that is a nice dish, yeah. I would, I would buy it again. Yes, I would buy it again. It's ideal. It's quick. It's a microwavable dish. Six and a half minutes, eight hundred watts. Max out of ten. I'd could probably give it. Um, I'd probably give it a. Phew, 
probably probably an eight, seven and a half to eight, seven and a half to eight, and I would buy it again. It's not a bad dish. You get a lot there as well. I'm going to get into this now, so I might see you tonight. Tonight I might not. So if I do, if I, if I do, I do. If I don't, I don't. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Take care. All the best, and I'll catch you on the next one.